Well, 4th of July weekend is here. You're gonna be outside. You have absolutely the perfect timing to pick up on some sales that we're bringing to you at HSN. It is the Earthwise. It's an eight inch convertible electric chain slash pole saw that is that lowest price of 119, but it's a temporary price. You see how we just converted it to a pole saw, to a, um, hold on, this is crazy. Look at this, it converts to a chainsaw from the pole saw and back and forth. And comes with this case. Please use safety goggles. Peter could call it. I've already got my glasses okay, on. Okay. But yeah, you're exactly right. Here's what's so great about this. Two and one. And Earthwise has always brought us so many great items that do not have to deal with gas. You don't have to deal with fumes and you don't have to deal with all that extra noise. This is a pole saw and a handheld chainsaw. So maybe you thought, oh, maybe I need a chainsaw, but I need that pole saw. What's better than two and one? Something that does both. And here's what I want you to see. When you're looking at this as that pole saw, mm -hmm. it's fantastic. But to go from the pole saw to that chainsaw is so simple. Honestly, it's okay. genius when you see this. Look at this. So I've got a button right here, and you can see it goes together. I pull that button apart right there. So now I've got that one section. And I'll slide this section up. So same thing down here. I've got the button right there. I'm gonna pull that button, separate that. So Man, basically, all I'm doing is taking the pole out of the middle and then connecting that together. So now I have that handheld chainsaw that weighs less than Isn't six pounds. All you need to do is add your extension cord and, you're done. and you can handle this. Can I talk? This is very manageable, Peter. It right. absolutely is. It's Look at not that. overwhelming. And I think that's that's key. No, right? exactly. Because but it if, still gets the job done. If you've seen though, you know what? Hold that right there for a second. I will hold this. Look at this. Here's what's unnecessary. Holy smoke! <laughs> for that all of us, this is where you've got you've got to put the oh here this is what everyone loves this thing. Yeah. Remember you pull this even for oh. the lawnmower things like yeah. that. You don't need this is why you don't have a handheld chainsaw because you think it has to be this intimidating, has to be this loud, has yeah. to deal with the gas and the fumes. You don't. I always we, I point this out. It's got all these instructions on the back to start it and that primer bulb, you gotta deal with that whole thing. You don't have to do that. I'm gonna show you how easy That's it is to use this. That's why you have tips with your neighbor right. because they decide to do chainsaw work with that kind of thing at eight in the morning on a weekend. Right, you don't need that. For many of us, we wanna take care of those limbs. So think about it, you remember the winter time. So you've got limbs that are getting close to the house. They're getting close to the windows. You may have those branches that are getting low and close to the cars in the driveway. You are going to be able to use the chainsaw to not only cut those limbs overhead because you're gonna have that reach at over nine feet in length, you're gonna be able to reach up above and get those limbs cut. Then you're gonna be able to cut them to size for firewood. This can do it all and you don't have to decide, okay. do I want a handheld chainsaw or do I want to have the pole saw? You, you get, get them, both. You get them both. I've just been updated. There are fewer than 150 left. Wow. Okay, so take us through this big old log here. Yeah, so I've got a big limb, and this is typical of what you're gonna see. Because we have that eight inch bar and chain, eight inch bar and chain is this area right here, so that's eight yeah. inches. You've got your chain there, Oregon chain, which is basically the industry standard. You've got that same chain that you see on that big, large, intimidating one. But you can handle limbs approaching eight inches in diameter. That is a, a very large limb, so you're gonna love that. Easy to use, very lightweight. So I'll, I'll go through this one limb right here, and okay. you're gonna see that it is so simple that you're just letting the saw do the work for you. Like butter. What wow. you're gonna notice about this is, and what I love about it so much is that you're, you're not gonna it's be fighting with this. You're not gonna be intimidated by it, because watch, all I'm doing is starting that up, resting it down on the limb. Now let the saw do the work for you just like that. So you, you don't have to be strong. You don't have to have a ton of experience with this. You're not fighting with that chainsaw. This whole thing weighs less than six pounds. Do you realize my purse is heavier than that? Oh, I believe uh, it. Yeah. I, my wife, right. Debbie, right? Yeah. She's got a big purse as well, and it can be heavy. So less than six pounds, than six but pounds. not intimidating. So for the ladies out there, this isn't something you're saying, I've got to wait for my husband to do it or get my son or anyone else to do it. You can handle that. But you can go from that to right our pole saw let me grab that real quick it converts you don't need an engineering degree we have that final hundred or so and it it is uh free shipping and handling today and four for a fourth of july weekend okay here we go now again less than 10 pounds to have this pole saw so i have it fully collapsed but you can extend this out 
No now, ladder. No ladder required. Yeah, oh yeah, exactly. If you if you have a chainsaw and anybody is getting up on a ladder Please. with a chainsaw, we certainly highly recommend you not doing that. But look at the amount of reach that you have with this. Siobhan, would you just step back even further because okay, bye -bye. I want to show you how we can <laughs> do some of the cutting up ahead here or okay. up above. Yeah. So I just want to make sure we do that. Same thing. Just rest that down on the branch just like that. And now let's do the second branch here as well. Just rest it on the limb. And that's it. The whole thing weighs less than 10 pounds. You can absolutely handle this. I'm just over six feet tall. But when I get this fully extended and I reach up above, I'm really able to handle branches that are 9, 10, 11 feet above my head. And if you were to run outside now and think about all those branches that are causing the problems, you'd be surprised how many of them are much lower than that. You'll be able to handle all of them with something like this pole saw. You will absolutely love this. You're gonna use it now if you haven't been cutting those, those limbs down that are overgrown. You know, mm -hmm. we experience a lot of this massive growth into the spring, into the summer. But more importantly, you wanna get this home now. Check it out, try it out, but you wanna use it again in the fall, before the, the, the fall, before the winter storms, those ice storms, you know what they do with those limbs and the branches, everything gets further down. If you have dead wood, you wanna make sure you get rid of that now, so none of that is falling down with the high winds and the winter storms. So I think fall is the really, that's the season you need it. You've gotta have it for sure. There are a lot of you joining us. There are fewer than 100. Okay, fewer wow. than 100 available. It is the last quantity for the season. It's not like we're going back and bringing in another five, 6,000. It is that final 100 or so that you're gonna be able to get right now. It's six pounds when it's the chainsaw. It's under 10 pounds when you do the pole saw. So you know what? You can take on jobs that you might be thinking about hiring someone right. for. Or maybe it is for, we're talking about how it's for gals. It could be for a guy who's maybe, you know, not necessarily back to that old chainsaw that stinks anyway. You, sure. Here's something that's totally manageable, but can take on the limbs, low, high, hedges, you name it. And they're going. Oh, good, I'm so excited that you're getting this because this is one of those things that'll get you back into uh, this brand once you get this. Yeah, exactly, and, and I think what you said is absolutely true. You are now doing jobs that without something like this, you absolutely had to pay someone to do, but now you can handle it on your own. Siobhan, I know you're gonna head inside. I am because there's an, a situation that's cool inside. It's called air conditioning? It's called, well, it's even better. Well, I'll handle this. Okay, thank you, dear. And you're coming up with Lori Leland I, next? I am, you're so good. Okay. We have fewer than 80 now available. Great. I bet this is going to sell out, Peter. I'll do my best. I love you, to Peter. Bye, bye, know. Peter. Bye. Thank you. Happy Fourth of July, Peter. Thank you. <laughs> Some of the things I want you to know about this is, again, it's very easy to use. It's very lightweight. But here's all we have to do. We have that eight-inch bar and chain. The only thing we have to do is add our bar and chain oil right there. So once you add that, there's a little window there, so you can know that it has oil in it. It has an automatic oiling system at that at that point. So when you're using it, you're going to automatically lube that bar and chain, and you're set to go. Other than that, we're just getting our extension cord. I'm going to put this down here. You're going to add your extension cord to the back right here, whether you're using it as the pole saw or the chainsaw. But here's what's important. Safety button right here. So I can't just pull that trigger without also hitting that safety switch as well. When you hit the safety switch, you can activate that. When you let go, you always have to go back to that safety switch. So you always know that it's safe. When you let go of that switch, the noise stops, everything stops. You can definitely handle this. You've got the pole saw, then in less than 10 seconds, you can convert this to that handheld chainsaw as well. So you're taking down limbs from up overhead. 10, 11 feet in the air, and then you're able to maybe cut them to the proper size to just put them at the street and have them taken away or for firewood as well. So we're wrapping